Final question on the left. Hey, Coach. Ramona Shelburne, ESPN. Uh, this is probably oversimplifying things, but sometimes when, when teams play against Jokic, you, you turn him into a scorer, you turn him into a passer, and he controls the game. You, he only had four assists tonight. Yeah, that, that, that's a ridiculous, you know, it's just, that's the untrained eye that, that says something like that. This guy's an incredible player. You know, twice in two seasons, he's been the best player on this planet. You can't just say, oh, make him a score. <laughs> That's not how they play. They, they have so many different actions that just get you compromised. Uh, we have to focus on what we do. Um, you know, we try to do things the hard way, um, and he requires you to do many things the hard way. Um, and we, he has our full respect. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Coach. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Ramona Shelburne, in, in the nicest way possible, in like the most PC way possible, got called the fucking casual. <laughs> that's that's crazy. That is that is crazy. Um, listen, man, it's it's cool. It's cool. Um, I think Eric Spolstra has been involved, watched enough, coached enough players to have the right to. Truly call motherfuckers casuals, like for real, for real. You know. Um, but what I what I will say is though, is that Eric Spolster was right. I don't even think this was I don't think this is a clip to really have crazy conversations about. People should not should not be having think pieces over this um tweet. But I think the the whole mentality of just let Jokic be a scorer does not make sense to me as well. Like, you don't just let someone be a scorer. Like, you, like Jokic is Jokic, and your job is to, like, limit certain actions and certain advantages that he can create, and that's just your game plan. Like your 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 job as a coach is like to essentially manage risks. Um so as a coach, you would rather um like essentially what I'm saying here is just letting Jokic not like their game plan wasn't just to let Jokic score. It was within the system of how Denver runs things, let's just shut down everyone else. Is letting Jokic get his just allowing him to just be a scorer? I don't know. Maybe it's just a semantics conversation at this point. Um, but yeah, the untrained eye is crazy. <laughs> the un <laughs> look at look at Spo's face, bro. Look at Spo's face. Now, I have personally never seen him be this stressed though. I will say that it, it was it was giving. <laughs> That's in the replies. It was giving uh, Giannis after, ironically enough, getting beat by the Heat. You know what I'm saying? Just just getting frustrated with dumb questions, at least in their in their eyes. I, I personally didn't think it was the right uh, the the worst question in the world. I, let me listen to it again. Me? Was it really that hey, bad of a question? Michelle, ESPN. Uh, this is probably oversimplifying things, but sometimes when, when teams play against Jokic, you, you turn him into a scorer, you turn him into a passer, and he controls the game. You, he only had four assists tonight. Yeah, that, that, that's a ridiculous, you know, it's just, that's the untrained eye that, that says something like that. This guy's an incredible player. You know, twice in two seasons, he's been the best player on this planet. Yeah, I think their game plan wasn't just to let him either be a scorer or a passer. I don't know. Now, to Ramona's credit, though, she did say, yeah, this is probably like an oversimplification of what it is. But it's it's a non-issue to me, man. It's just a funny clip because Eric Spolster generally, uh, genuinely, excuse me, looks hella frustrated. 